Hi there, this is Anub. Today we are going to talk about an interesting topic. Probably most of you have not noticed this. This is kind of half-baked thing from Microsoft side maybe. This is all about managed app filter for Android and iOS devices. And one of the very interesting option which I have noticed in Intune portal. So I thought of sharing it with you all. So this is going to be a very cute video. So to find out more, you have to watch the video. So don't skip it. Let's go ahead and watch it out. We have two videos about Intune filters or Intune filter rules. So I'm not going to cover everything in this slide. So I will directly go into the demo after quickly going through this slide. So we have already covered Intune filters in detail and we have two videos about Intune filters and you can get all the details from YouTube itself if you click on the I button on the right side of the YouTube screen of the YouTube video you would get Intune design decisions playlist and Intune training playlist so you can refer to that playlist to get Intune filter details so I'm not going to cover the entire details in this slide but quickly wanted to remind you about Intune filters by just going through these slides and we will directly go into the demo this is how you normally create filters you just need to log into Intune admin center portal and then you can create filters from devices node as well as some other places like tenant administration etc but let's go to devices and then scroll down to find the filters option over here if you click on filters option you will be able to see all the filters which you have already created in your tenant and you can see the filter name platform and last modified date and here is the option to create new filters click on this plus create button over here you would be able to see two types of filters that you can create managed devices managed applications managed devices are most commonly used filters managed filters are pretty new and we are going to concentrate on managed filters and particularly for iOS and Android devices let's create one managed apps filter for iOS device first so I have created a filter name and description now I need to select the platform over here so let's select the platform as iOS and the manage filter supports only iOS and Android at the moment as you can see over here and click on next over here this is similar to device filter etc etc there's no difference in the UI so I'm going to select a property over here if you check the list of properties over here you can see something app version this is very interesting this is what we are going to check out today what is this how you can test it is it fully baked or it is kind of half baked is there any Microsoft documentation available about this etc so I'm going to select app version and I'm going to select not equal to as an operator and I'm going to put a random value one over here to find out what is this all about and how to find out that you need to make this rule available over here if you remove the mouse pointer from here and click on here rule syntax will automatically appear over here app dot app version not equal to one now here is our preview friend and that is going to help you to understand more about this app version what does this app version property and how to use it etc click on preview and that will bring you up another blade over here preview devices blade and in that preview devices blade you can see app version over here app version it says 2.73 unmanaged etc etc OS version is different from app version so we will find out more details about what is this app version it is a bit confusing and I checked Microsoft documentation and I couldn't find any mention about app version in Microsoft documentation as well so we will find out more details but the process of creation of Intune app filters is same as device filters click 
next and create now let's check where i can find this particular app version so if i bring a ios device over here and check the discovered apps i don't see any apps related to that version it says 52303 that is the only discovered app i can see that is company portal we have discussed about this in more details in the previous video about intune inventory you can refer to that video if you click on i button in youtube so the version number of company portal is different from the version number shown in the discovered apps now there's an interesting tab over here managed app tab and if you click on that managed app tab you can see two managed applications over here one is notes and the other one is facebook for this particular device but there's no version details because it is still waiting for install status and the other one is not installed okay so i cannot confirm anything from this screen at the moment let's go back and check another filter that is android device filter so let's create one manage apps and then say filter name description and you need to select the platform as android okay android is selected click on next to continue now over here i'm going to select the same app version property and use the same method to identify what is the app version for managed android device not equal to value 1 and then the rule syntax you can see over here and if you click on preview button over here you can see there are two preview devices you can see as per this particular filter rule based on app dot app version not equal to 1 so two app versions over here one is 4.2316 other one is 4.2311 and it is android enterprise samsung device all those details are there now we need to find out what is this app version from where this is coming i'm going to open and android device over here click on android device and then go to android devices and click on the android device that i have so if i go over here under discovered applications for easy understanding what i did is i opened this portal on the left side so that i can see the preview of devices for that particular android filter rule with the app version and over here i have opened the android for work managed device properties and i am in discover apps tab and i'm checking whether there is any app with this particular app version this particular app version over here it is 4.23 and i'm quickly going through it don't see anything over here otherwise what you can do is you have an option to export for example export i have exported i'm going to search for this particular version in this spreadsheet 4.23 find all and 4.23 find all i can't find any versions like that over here there's an interesting tab over here in this also managed app click on that managed apps you can see microsoft outlook and microsoft outlook version if you look at it is same 4.23164 the app version shown in the filter rule preview and the managed app outlook is same so this filter is based on managed app and that managed app is microsoft outlook in this scenario but there should be more filters isn't it to filter out based on specific managed app name and version so we will wait for more details from microsoft to understand how this works and what is the expectation etc now you know the relation between app version property and managed app version at least for android devices could be same for ios devices but ios device which i have shown is byo device and the managed apps are not installed that is why it is not showing any app versions please refer to the description of the video to get the latest information from microsoft on this whenever microsoft releases new information i will add the latest information to the description of the video so do check that out now that you have seen all the details about new attribute new property available in intune called app version and how you can relate app version with managed app in android context and in ios context it is bit different if your device is not abm 
managed abm plus intune managed hope this was helpful thank you all for watching see you around